Hi, I'm Maryam, co-founder of Isono Health. We have developed a platform that will, that will empower women to take charge of their own health with regular breast health monitoring. Our platform combines automated ultrasound with machine learning to track abnormal changes and find the earliest onset of breast cancer. While I was at Stanford getting my PhD, my friend Kelly walked in for a routine checkup and ended up with a diagnosis for breast cancer. I was just shocked, she's not even 30. She's really lucky because they caught it early. And after a short treatment, she's now healthy and she has a two-year-old boy. But every year, there are one and a half million women in, uh, around the world that get diagnosed, 300,000 just in the US, and many of them are not that lucky. One in three of breast cancers are missed at early stage. That's one in three. You might ask why? Because breast cancer screening is sporadic. It's inaccessible to millions of women, especially younger women like Kelly. And for women who do have access, it doesn't work for half of them because of X-ray radiation doesn't work with dense breasts. And it exposes them to unnecessary radiation. And women who are at higher risk due to family history or genetics, they need even more regular monitoring. We have the solution. Our patented technology is a 3D ultrasound scanner that can automatically scan the entire volume of the breast. It attaches to a wearable for hands-free, repeatable imaging. It takes only two minutes per month without any radiation, as easy as using your smartphone. Our machine learning on the back end can identify and tag abnormal masses like here, and then we can track changes over time. This is the key to early detection, finding early changes. In fact, we've already completed a clinical study with 100 women, and we've demonstrated the sensitivity of our device. On the right-hand side, you can see four millimeter-sized tumors. Today, there are over 8 million women just in the U.S. that are extremely high risk of breast cancer and desperate for a new solution. At $300, this is a $4 billion adopter market. But we're not stopping here. By lowering the barrier to access with a monthly subscription fee, we make breast cancer screening accessible to millions of more women and further expand the addressable market to $32 billion. We have a rock star team. From hardware engineers to medical device experts, from Stanford, Carnegie Mellon, and Harvard, and an expert team of medical, clinical, and business advisors were passionate about democratizing breast cancer screening. We already have a fully functioning system. Earlier this year, we're part of Y Combinator. Since then, we have completed the clinical study, made uh, uh, impressive improvements in our, uh, in our device, and we're well on our way to get our CE mark and FDA 510K approval, and we'll be launching next year. Most of us, breast cancer has affected us in some way or another. We want to make sure that no woman has to die from breast cancer. We have the smart technology behind this, and we want to make sure you join us in saving women's lives. Please come see a live demo of our product. Good job, Isono Health. Thank you. Judges, questions, comments? Uh, can you explain how the product works? Like, do you, you have your own bra? Do you, do you send the bra every month? Um, so, um, so yes, we, uh, so for high-risk women, uh, they want to, uh, one way we talk to a lot of them, they want to have the device at home. But we also, as we grow, we have a monthly subscription where we can send you the, uh, the scanner once a month. The beauty of our platform is that it's completely modular. So a scanner can scan every woman, and the, uh, the bra part is personal to you. So we can send a, a device to you once a month, you use it, and then you send it back. So there's a monthly subscription uh, uh, fee that we can uh, Is the, uh, the cost of the actual device embedded into that thirty dollars a month? Because it's it's a you know three sixty a year or whatever. It's yes. it's not a low end price point. Yes. So, are you going after sort of a market that obviously can afford that? What what segment of the market is that? 
Um, initially, uh, so we're, we're starting with high-risk women, and then after that, we're going uh, more to a B2B2C model where we've actually taught insurance companies might cover this. We actually talked to uh, corporate wellness, uh, uh, you know, um, uh, that will cover part of this. So we're going after that B2B2C model that will cover part of that monthly subscription fee. But but the, 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 uh, but the price is built into that, yes. Got time for one more question. Nothing? All right, good job, Isono Health. Thank you.